Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is part of the YouTube Cross Channel Challenge. This is the last month of the challenge. It was a, a year-long challenge put on by Daniel Dubois over at Turnage Dubois. Um, I'll have links to his YouTube channel, all his stuff. Uh, so Tim over at Bad Apple Woodworks had the December, the last month of the challenge, and he chose holiday. It could be anything, Hanukkah, Christmas, New Year's, whatever, just anything to do with a holiday. So, urchin ornament. So, stick around, watch how I make it. We'll talk about it at the end. So, see you then. I love Christmas. So we got these things dyed. I've got a couple of coats of deft on that, which uh, I'll show you some of that on the finishing coat, but I need to get a small hole drilled straight across here for a hanger or a wire or whatever we're gonna do. So, you can see that a little bit. Yeah. 
What I want to do is I want to go halfway in this side, spin this around, come in this side. So as best as I can, not to blow it out on the other side. There we go. I'll add a little bit of dye right there to cover up that small blowout. Once that's dyed, you won't even notice it. So I'll be back when we're uh, ready to spray our final coat of finish on this. All right, here's the dropper, the bottom part of the ornament. And uh, I left it on there just so I got a handle. It's already cut to size down there for the bottom of the urchin. So that's good to go. All I've got to do is spray this, let it dry, part that off, and we can start gluing it back onto the urchin. So anyway, what I'm using is a product that I love. I'm not sponsored by nobody with this. It's Daft. Semi-gloss. You can sand this stuff back, whatever. Dries good, tough finish, so anyway, we'll just basically, I'm about 12 inches away, 10 inches away on this. Just a nice finished last coat on that. All right, well, it's the best time of the project. We've got our urchin. He's a small little guy too. We've got our dropper. We've got our cap piece. We're going to attach everything with some Starbond medium. There's links for a 10% discount in the description box. Go check it out. Save you a little bit of money. Thanks to Starbond. So, got some accelerator too. I don't know if you can see it, but I've got some 17 pound fishing line just so you have something to hang it from it you can use a hook or or whatever so Christmas hook Christmas ornament hook line this blends really good into the tree so you don't even see it if you're gonna hang it you can hang this thing year-round whatever so anyway let's uh let's attach this thing so I think we'll start off with the cap piece And this stuff works really good on these urchins. Give it a little twist. All right, we will repeat that process for the bottom. There we go. All right, I'll get the string on there, and uh, we'll be back. Talk about it. There it is, folks. All put together. Got the dropper in. Got the cap. I just used some fishing line, like I said, for that. So all right, came out really good. So, like I said before, this is part of the YouTube Cross Channel Challenge set by Daniel Dubois over at Turnage Dubois. Again, I'll have links to everybody's challenges. I've missed a few. Um, everybody gets busy, so I'll try to make those up, I guess, maybe if i got time. But uh, anyway, great challenge, Daniel. I'd like to thank Daniel and everybody who participated in setting this up. Created challenge uh, projects for the months. Uh, that, that was a cool deal. So I had, I really enjoyed myself, Daniel, on this. So um, hopefully we can do something like this again next year. I don't know. Three month challenges, one month single challenges, whatever. Another year long uh, thing. But it, but it was fun. So anyway, back to this urchin cap piece drop dropper. It's about three inches long. The dropper and. Uh, so these are great, great little projects. They're fast, they're easy to turn. Get you uh, practice on your finials, all that good stuff. So anyway, great challenge. Check it out. So leave me a like, a dislike, a 
comment. Let me know what you guys think about it. So it all helps the channel. So anyway, this will probably be the last project that I do for the year. Um, let's get close to Christmas, enjoy some family, all that good stuff. So thanks to everybody involved with the challenge. All the makers, everybody, I hope everybody has a happy holidays, Merry Christmas, whatever you celebrate, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, man, whatever. So uh, just enjoy yourself, enjoy your family, enjoy your friends. I'm out.